Uh, so let's talk about last week. Bunny. Yes. Let, let, let's get down to brass tacks here, gentlemen. Um, so it, were you sober last week during the podcast? Were you clean during the podcast? I, I was, week? I was as high as I, as I ever was. So you were, you were high. Yeah. Last week. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. But because, I'm high every week. I, I've only yeah. in three years I've only I've only missed like one day. Okay. <laughs> All right. Because last week well well let me just let me just say the story. Our last break in the last episode I came out and I, I, I came out to the kitchen to get some water and, and Natasha, my wife, was there and she said, Oh good, you're done and I said, No, we're taking a break, an emergency break, because bunny needed to pee we're still talking about the movie <laughs> and my wife said why are you still talking about that horrible crappy movie and i said well i'm not entirely sh- sure why but bunny understands the movie in a, a deep philosophical level that other people don't and uh, i'm not 100 percent sure about this but i think that bunny might be a little bit sober and it's scaring me <laughs> Is what happened during that last break, but for know. for whatever reason, and again, that's that's art. Um, it affected me in a way that it didn't affect you, and it's it it doesn't matter with an art film. Yeah, I mean that's art. It either speaks to you on some level or it doesn't. Yeah, you know, and it didn't it didn't speak to me. Did speak to me last week. So, so like, me. like I felt I was inside the mind of Crispin Glover, and it's really kind of a fucked up place to be. Yeah, that's a frightening place to be inside the mind of. Have you tried rewatching Crispin it? Glover? No, 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 no. I've been focused entirely on the Holy Mountain this week. Yeah, because I watched, I watched it again over over the weekend with Jeannie. Yeah. Cause I, cause I wanted her take, but like she was kind of prepped knowing that I, that I saw yeah. a lot in this movie. Yeah. I imagine she was prepped, you know? So, so right from the get go, she was looking for things. Yeah. I, I may do this. I may not. I'm flaky when it comes to ideas that I come up with sometimes, yeah. but what I want to do is trick one of the girls, <laughs> Emerald or Amber, Probably not Bella, but Emerald or Amber, and force them to sit down and watch uh, this week's movie, The Holy Mountain, with me, and I and we record some uh, audio commentary for it. Yeah, I was re-listening to Bella and I's audio commentary for the Three Caballeros, and and it was just so much fun. And I feel like I haven't done that like I've only done that once, and I just yeah. thought this would be a good movie because no one can be prepared for this week's film. Mm-hmm. You know, well, this movie. For, first off, I liked it. I liked it a lot. It didn't speak to me on the same level as Crispin Glover did. This is this is more. This is more of a cinematic kind of a thing. I mean, anything you could read into is is completely up. Op- Let's save that for later. Okay. Okay. It just didn't affect me on the same level as the Crispin Glover. Yeah. Uh, Although I I think I would say Holy Mountain is, is a superior movie. Oh yes. It's a beautiful film. It's a beautiful film. 